All right, y'all. I'm about to try the Beyond Meat Burger at Carl's Jr. If you're on the East Coast, you might know it better as Hardee's. I don't know if they have it at Hardee's, but Carl's Jr. definitely got it. I'm about to order that, and it's something for my wife too, so y'all stay tuned for your boy. Can I please get uh, the Beyond B uh, Burger, the, the Famous Star? Can I get it with um, the yeah combo, please? Small. <laughs> Can I get it? Could you add guacamole? Okay. Could you add guac to the burger? Okay. Uh, fruit punch, high C. Okay, and can I get you? Yes. Also, can I get the, the what's the double jalapeno burger combo? The number nine. Let me see. No, no, no. The the smaller burger with the two, with the jalapenos. Yeah, the number nine or the single jalapeno burger. No, it. The number nine is the jalapeno burger to the top No, no, no. The the uh the double deal. Uh, you want the double jalapeno burger with the combo? Yes. Small. And what type of drink? A high C fruit punch. Okay. And that'll be all. Okay, so thank you, baby. Thank you. Thanks. Hi. So I had to get the guacamole added to the burger. It makes it basically the bigger burger uh, with the guac burger with the bacon. But you know, vegans and uh, vegetarians don't eat bacon. So let's see what they're talking about. Ride with your boy. Y'all stay tuned. So here's the unveiling of Cars Jr. Beyond Meat Burger. This is the one I just got. I added guacamole to it. So let's check it out. You know. Okay. It's looking pretty good. So far, get rid of this. We got some ketchup on there. A little drizzle of the ketchup. Y'all check that out. Okay, a little wetness. Whoa. The camera, whoa, you're right, Anna. The camera, the camera don't do it justice. Let me see, I'm gonna just gonna take this off completely. Mm. So those of you who haven't been following the Beyond Meat uh, saga, you guys are missing out. Look at that, woo! It's been cold, that's why I probably look a little bit dry or whatever, but I, so I had it for a minute now because I was waiting for the baby and all kind of stuff. Anyway. It's not fresh and hot, but I'm going to eat it anyway. But if y'all ain't been on the Beyond Meat craze lately, y'all been missing out. The stocks for this has been going through the roof. So if y'all investors out there, y'all need to look into the Beyond Meat. Uh, it's probably too late now because it's already high, so y'all missed out. Tomato in there, onion, lettuce, mayo at the bottom. Y'all see that? All right, I'm about to bite into it. And let y'all know, is this worth your money, your funds? Mmm. 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 Pickle. Caught me off guard. Got a little. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. That's how it is when you bite into it. I'm not quite sure what plant-based products they put in this, but <coughs> it's a good burger. The onion kind of throwing me off. Maybe next time I get, <coughs> I'll get it with no onion. Mm. 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 That guacamole. Up there, mixed with the ketchup at the top. They put that added guac up there. Mm hmm. You don't gotta be vegan to eat this. You don't gotta be a vegetarian. You know what I'm saying? You can be like your boy and eat everything. Got the man boobs. You feel me? Mm. If you get this burger, don't forget to add the guac. You gotta add the guac. The Beyond Meat patty is real meat 
it looks like meat, like a meat patty, like a beef patty, but it's soft. Let me say it again. It's soft. Real soft. It's like you got to take care of it like you do your lady. Mm. It's not soft to where as they fall apart. Some veggie burgers you get, you bite them and they fall, crumble apart. It's not crumble apart soft where it makes a mess. It's like the outside is cooked just right and the inside is well put together and and and, 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 and delicious and I gotta take another bite. Mm. My wife said it ain't that good. I don't like this one. Well, I had it from there. You ain't had it from the car, Junior. Exactly. So, I don't like that kind of texture. <laughs> when it's soft in the inside? I'm like, you must, you know. It's not as heavy. You don't get that heaviness. Yeah. She like that heaviness. Because she want to feel bloated. Yeah. This is When you get done eating this, you're not going to feel bloated. You can still walk around. You can still go outside and throw football, play basketball. Play tennis, you can still jump on the NBA Live 19 PS4. That's the great thing about this movement of uh, conscious food is that when you eat stuff like this, it don't weigh you down. You know, I can eat one of these and go. I run around a block one time, just once. Cause I'm fat. What do to my baby? But on the rate, we going <laughs> one through ten. You know, uh, <coughs> we don't give it a seven. Um. You know, if it don't get all over the place, it don't belong in your face. <clears throat> Look at that. Don't fall. Wallace, throw that away. What? That paper right there on the floor, right there. What? <laughs> yeah, throw it away, please. Tana, give me that. No, she's gonna eat it. Let's pick it up and throw it away. Mm-hmm. This is seven. You can get it how you want to get it. I got it with everything. You know, a lot of... Not a lot. Vegans don't eat cheese. This got cheese on it. A lot of people don't eat dairy. This got cheese on it. Me, I eat it all. I'm just being real. Say what you want to say about your boy. I think I'm gonna get it definitely without the onions next time. Um, probably no pickles either. No lettuce. Just give me that behind me. Extra tomato. Guacamole. Cheese. <coughs> Mayo. Ketchup. It should be straight. But if you like pickles, by all means. Put pickles on it. But I'm just glad now that you have a better choice at fast food restaurants. At least for Carl's Jr. Maybe McDonald's will catch on. At one time, Burger King had a veggie burger. It was horrible. Like, horrible. Um, excuse me. She got the whole thing. So, man. Oh, my God. No, get out of there. Thank you. And me a peppermint on my door, please. A what? Peppermint. Peppermint? In here? The next one. This one? The onions? You definitely gonna need some of these peppermints, baby. I need one for myself, too. Back up, Savannah. Okay. 
All right, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe. You want some? She can have some. You want to have a taste of meat? No, she can get the pickle and the bread. There you go. <coughs> it's not meat, Athena. It's plant-based protein. But I'm still not going to give it to my daughter yet. I don't think she's ready for it. And like I said in one of my previous videos, we don't uh, give our daughter any meat. <clears throat> not even... Uh, well, you know what? She has had protein-based meat before, huh, Panda? With the uh, veggie chili. She she likes the veggie chili. And that has the fake uh, protein meat <coughs> in it. You probably want to drink this with a nice cold drink. I got mine in the refrigerator because I drank my other drink. So I'm going to end the video. And go get my drink. I love tomatoes. In case y'all was curious to really see what this. <laughs> okay, Panda. You're so bossy like your mama. Hmm. No, you got you already got bread in your hand. If y'all was curious to actually see. You want water? Hold on. Let me uh, switch the camera. Huh. You get your water, mama. Y'all want to see what the meat actually is? It's like grilled. You feel me? So it's official. Or try to say the beyond meat because this is beyond meat. You feel me? Like meat is right here, and this is beyond it. You know what I'm saying? Like to infinity and beyond. Story, Toy Story Four about to come out, y'all. Definitely gotta watch that. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, yeah, it was definitely fleshy. Got that char broil on there. Mm-hmm. That's what caused. I'm. I'm pretty sure that's what caused cancer. That's what caused cancer. The char broil. That's it. I done figured out the cure, y'all. I mean, the reason. It's a char broil. Hi. 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 I'm about to go. Get my Gatorade. Nice and frosty out the refrigerator. Get my baby. Which one? My baby, baby, or my baby? Or my baby, baby, baby. I got three babies. Four babies. Sheba, my baby puppy. My wife, that's my baby. Hey, babe. Hi, babe. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> my wife is so funny. <laughs> because we think that people who call each other babe are the most, not ridiculous, but most comic relationship couples ever. They just be like, hey, babe. Yeah, babe. I'll be late, babe. Babe, can you pick me up something from Walmart, babe? Yeah, okay. Babe. Yeah, babe. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> This is so funny to us. And then I was teasing her on um, Facebook on Father's Day. <laughs> I was like, yeah, babe. <laughs> I don't know if she caught it, but that's when she was uh, giving me my Father's Day shout out. <laughs> Woo. What, what's our pet names? Yeah, yeah our, our, pet. our pet names is, uh, she's always called me Pookie. I call her that back just because I think it's funny. Um, but I call her Pretty Girl. That's my pet name for her is Pretty Girl. So, she's Pretty Girl, and I'm Buki. That onion. You don't need one of these, baby. Whew. Yeah, this is a booty whack. Look at her. Stop saying the butt.